Sister Teresa Sebastian, Sister Tulsi the Principal, and the uh, fellow citizens of this country. We know the Congress Party ever since the Lahore Conference wanted to celebrate India's independence. For that, for them, they decided they wanted, especially from any 30 onwards, they have they have been celebrating the India's independence in their own way and wishing that Purna Swaraj should be there for India. And they chose the January 26th as the day for India to be independent. And they have been celebrating this day as Purna Swaraj Day. But the things changed ever since the Second World War and Mount Batten won the Japanese war. He was preference to have Independence Day on, on August 15th. So that India became independent on August 15th. That was a plan and desire of Mount Batten. So it was to be declared on January 26th. Instead of that, he anticipated India's independence to uh, you know, uh, yeah, August 2015. And that is a uh, story behind. And then ever since afterwards, India became independent. And this January 26 became the Republic Day. And before that, the Constituent Assembly was in session from 1947 till 1949. Or 19, in, uh, in 1949, on November 26th, they finalized the constitution and hand over to the people concerned. It was allowed to be promulgated on January 26th. And as we look at the preamble of the constitution, framed by the Constituent Assembly of India, we find solemn words there. We, the people of India, Having solemnly resolved to constitute India into a sovereign, socialist, secular, democratic republic and secure to all its citizens justice, social, economic, and political, liberty of thought, expression, faith, and belief, and worship, equality of status and of opportunity and to promote among them all the dignity, fraternity, assuring the dignity of the individual and integrity and unity of the nation. In our constituent assembly, uh, this is the day of November 1949, we declare, we adopt and give to ourselves uh, this constitution. These were the sort of words pronounced by the Constituent Assembly. And this is also a preamble of the Constitution. Look at the sort of words that are mentioned there. Equality, fraternity, liberty, these are all there. They were actually taken from the French Revolution slogan. Equality, and liberty and fraternity. And give me liberty or give me death. That is Thomas Jefferson. Uh, said in the American Constitution framer, one who made, and uh, during the struggle for American independence. Well, this, you know, the aspiration of the human mind. If you look at it, for everything else derives the Constitution from these three words important there liberty, fraternity, and equality. Today, that is at the stake in many ways when you look at it. People have least respect towards the freedom of others. The sense of equality is disappearing in the name of caste, class, and republics in our country. And there are unfortunately there are many people promoting a discriminatory attitude. But that is not what the constitution can visit. It really goes to the fundamental, the core of every human being to be equal with others. God created everybody equally. 
but we make love unequally. We unnecessarily make love unequally. And especially when we know the dignity of the persons and don't consider them as equal to me, equal to you. What happens is an revolt and then they get out. Discrimination is experienced. Unhappiness comes in. That's why these solemn words of the Constitution, I am sure, will be put into practice by all of you teachers. And especially if they appreciate the staff of the area of this school, the students are, because COVID not here now, the staff of this school, St. Luigi School, that has been doing tremendous service to the people around to inculcate in them these basic values and value of equality, value of charity, and value of liberty, from which also comes justice. Justice, economic, social, and political justice. Very important for all of us to lead a life as really responsible citizens. And that's why uh, during uh, the, uh, the celebration, as we celebrate the public day today, let us spread the day, light the founding fathers of the nation. Let us spread it to ourselves as well as to others, and that we will preserve. We will really preserve the dignity of the individual by upholding these values, equality, fraternity, and liberty. Jai Hind.